Remember back in the early days of Teen Mom 2 when so much of Janelle Evans' drama had to do with her tumultuous relationship with Kiefer Delp? Man, who would have thought that entire mess could ever be referred to as the good old days? For all of the arrests and the drug use, he really did seem to care about her, and she never claimed that he was abusive, which is something that can't be said for any of the other guys she was with on the show. The bar, as they say, is in hell. Janelle and Kiefer started dating in 2010, and while they broke up and got back together several times, they split for good in the fall of 2012. Since then, they've both been pretty busy. Janelle started dating her first husband, Cortland Rogers, about a week after breaking up with Kiefer, then they got married, then about a month after that she got back with another ex, Gary Head. She flip-flopped between Gary and Cortland for a bit, then met Nathan Griffith and got pregnant with Kaiser not too long after that. As for Kiefer, we don't know as much about what he's been up to because, you know, he didn't have his own reality show. Last month, he was released once again, and since then, he's been reconnecting with Teen Mom 2 fans on Twitter. And believe it or not, it seems like he's still got some feelings for his old flame. Kiefer somehow saw the tweet, and not only did he see it, but he felt moved to respond to all UN, as need to stop hatin' on ma bitch fr she up there doin' her thug thizzle, he re- Take as much time with that as you need. Ready? What in the world is that? Is that honestly Kiefer Delp referring to Janelle Evans as ma bitch in the year 2021? And he's defending her honor, too? What is a thug fizzle? This one single tweet raises so many questions, but if you can even stand it, this is isn't even the first time he's tweeted about her since he's been a free man. When he saw someone make fun of her recent weight gain, going as low as to call her pork Nelly, he replied, you shouldn't talk about other human beings like that. The same person told him that Janelle had been posting clickbait about him and his misfortunes, and to that he said, what misfortunes I don't care about none of that if she can get a lil bread tell her get it I ain't hatin'. And when someone else argued that she doesn't deserve that bread, Kiefer wrote, she seems to be doin' fine someone doesn't always have to be doin' bad for someone to be doin' good yadig. Like we said earlier, their relationship was definitely a disaster, but it's still oddly nice to see him defending her, isn't it? What won't be so nice, we're sure, is David reacting to this. But until then, let's just enjoy this while we can, ok?